Heart, don't fail me now. Courage, don't desert me. Don't turn back now that we're here. In my dreams, shadows call. There's a light at the end of a hall. Dancing bears, painted wings. Things I almost remember And a song someone sings Once upon a December Hi, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to episode 3 of Princess Post. I hope you guys have been enjoying all the content that I've been posting this past week. I'm so happy that I was able to get so much content out and I'm hoping that that won't stop, that I'll be able to keep going. But today I have something very, very special to unbox and review for you guys. So a lot of questions that I get on my Anastasia Instagram have to do with my wigs. A lot of people want to know where they can find an Anastasia wig for less than $100. Now, now let me just say that it's going to be very hard to find a completely already styled Anastasia wig or just a character wig in general for less than $100 because a lot of effort, a lot of time and talent goes into making wigs. So definitely keep that in mind and when you contact a wig stylist, try not to insult them by asking them if they can make their prices lower because their prices are set for a reason. Um, and yeah, I hear so many horror stories from some really great people that I go to for wigs and I feel so bad for them because, you know, you're paying, you're paying for art, basically. You're paying for um, time, supplies, and it's not cheap. Okay, so this is something, it was like a little project that I wanted to try for myself. As I said, I receive a lot of questions on my Anastasia Instagram. Where can I find a... Anastasia wig for less than $100. Some people have said, you know, they want $40 or less. And I was like, I honestly don't think you're going to be able to find any good quality pre-styled Anastasia wigs for that amount of money. But I did some digging. And on Amazon, I found that, um, I believe it's Cosplay Sky, had an Anastasia wig for about $20, US I want to say. Um... I couldn't buy from Amazon because they wouldn't ship to Australia from Amazon. So I actually went to the website instead. And they did. They shipped to Australia. So I believe this wig cost me 30 Australian dollars. Plus I could choose free shipping and it would ship within three to five weeks. Or I could spend 12 Australian dollars and it would ship in five days. And it shipped in five days it came really quick so this is it here i'm really really excited to unbox this for you try it on review it and um see if it's worth the quality Ugh, well the price i'm expecting it to i'm expecting the quality to match the price is what i'm trying to say because as i said it was pretty cheap for an anastasia wig Okay, they put it in two bags. Um, but I'm always happy to add another Anastasia wig to my collection. I did see some cosplayers wearing this wig, and it looked fine on them. Oh look, now it's in another bag. It's like Wig Inception. Um, and yeah, like, it seemed to be okay. Like, they looked good in it. So I'm hoping that I got a good one as well. Oh, I'm not sure how to open this. I might need my scissors. I'll be right back. Ooh. Oh, wow. Okay, so this is what it looks like in its packet. And I can already see that um, it's a good color. Like, it's the right color for Anya. Oh. Oh, wow. Okay, so it has this which I'm guessing you use to wrap around the ponytail um, because obviously she um, 
yet she's got that braid around her ponytail. But it doesn't look like the ponytail is already here. So I think I actually have to style it myself. Like, this is how it came. Which is really silly because it didn't say that on the website. Like, it didn't say you had to construct it yourself. I thought it would become, I thought it would like arrive pre-styled. All right, well, let's take it out and we'll have a look. Oh, oh, hang on. Oh, okay, so the ponytail, <laughs> the ponytail comes as a separate clip. I actually found it inside the wig. So I'm guessing I put the wig on, I clip the ponytail on, and then I wrap this around it. Um, I'm going to attempt to put this on and then we can talk about it. Okay, so I'm back. I've put the wig on and I put on a little bit more of like an Anya-esque kind of makeup. Um, so let's try and add some structure to this review because usually I just go all over the place. All right, application. First of all, the wig cap is really big. Not in a bad way, I just mean that if you have a lot of hair or you have thick hair, it's going to fit underneath this wig, which is great because I usually have thick hair, I usually have extensions, and everything fits underneath this wig. It was really, really easy to put together. It came in three pieces. You had the base wig, you had the ponytail, and then you had the braid here that goes around the ponytail. Now, I probably put this on in, I'd say, two to three minutes. It was really, really easy. Um, and you know what? It looks really good. So I do have to kind of experiment with this braid just a little bit so that you can't see the black clip from the ponytail. Um, but I didn't have to wrap it around twice. You just wrap it around once. It was exactly the right size. It fits perfectly. These bangs were out. So what I did was I brushed it a little bit and I just pinned it back because um, you can kind of see the pin here. Um, and you know what? It, it looks really, really good. Now let's talk about quality. Okay, so the color is spot on for Anya, I reckon. The hair feels soft, but it definitely feels synthetic. So I made a boo-boo before. I told you this was from Cosplay Sky. The website is cosplaywigs.com. I will put a link here. They also have a Dimitri one. I don't really like the Dimitri one. Um, just looking at it first glance, it's nowhere near as accurate. Accuracy for this one is pretty good. It's pretty good. It is a little bit long here. I don't really feel like Anya has a lot of hair here. She does definitely has a bit at the back. Um, I'll put up a picture somewhere for you so that you can kind of have a look. Um, so the color is great. The quality of the wig is nice. As I said, it feels soft, but you can definitely tell it's synthetic. You can definitely tell it's a cheap wig. I don't like how they've done this part here. It just looks really wishy-washy, like they did it really quickly. It's sort of messy, but you can't tell from far away. Um, I am a bit of a wig snob, so that is something that I will notice. But yeah, like, is it worth $30? Definitely, like, I think that's a really good price. I think it's a really good starter wig for people who don't really know about wigs. They don't know what they're doing. They don't want to spend a lot of money. I think this is a great starter wig for Anya. It's the right color. It's easy to put together. It's really cute. I do like the style. It feels very um, kind of more like an anime kind of hairstyle um, instead of like maybe a real life action kind of hairstyle. But when it comes to cartoon characters like Anastasia, Disney Princess, the more animated you look, I kind of feel like that works. I kind of feel like you're bringing the character to life. You look more like you're the cartoon that's just jumped out of your TV and you're just there. Um, but yeah, and I definitely don't think you need to pin or style the bangs if you don't want to. Um, it is already kind of pre-styled the way that they've sewn it into the part here. Um, it will stick and it will stay unless you brush, 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 brush. 
Um, I just wanted to pin mine back just a little bit just to kind of give it that oomph and that kind of um, big bang kind of look instead of it just sitting down like that. Um, but yeah, overall, I have to say I am pretty happy with this wig. Anyway, yeah, I quite like this wig. So I am going to turn around for you so you can kind of see the angles. And you can kind of see the back. What I might do is actually take it off later and put it on a wig head and put the ponytail maybe in a better place. I'll see. I don't know if I want it up higher or not. Guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I hope it kind of helped. If you're on my Instagram and you've asked me about an affordable, cheap Anastasia wig, seriously, I think this is the way to go. I honestly don't believe you need to spend hundreds and hundreds of dollars on a good quality wig. Definitely, if you're looking for a specific style, such as um, Megara from Hercules or even Aurora from Sleeping Beauty because obviously her bangs are very complex. But if you know how to style wigs, you can easily get away with a cheaper wig and you can just style it yourself. But yeah, if you are if you don't know anything about wigs, if you don't know how to style, honestly, there are so many really great websites out there where you can get a great quality wig that's not expensive and you don't have to do much to it. Like, I just literally just put this together, pinned the bangs back, and I think it looks decent. Like, I would wear this to a convention. And I think I might try this wig um, for my orphan Anya at a convention because I think this looks great. I might even try and style this so that it's my Grand Duchess wig, um, but when Rasputin and his minions kind of roughed her up a bit and her hair fell out a bit. But yeah, no. Definitely, if you are new to cosplay, if you're an Anastasia cosplayer, you want a cheap, easy wig that's not going to cost you millions, that's not going to cost you a lot of time to put together, go to cosplaywigs.com. I highly recommend this wig, definitely. And they also have quite a few other Disney princess wigs on there and um, wigs from animes as well. Thanks again so much for watching this video. I hope it helped. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this wig or if you've bought um, another wig from cosplaywigs.com. Let me know what you thought of the quality. Don't forget to like and subscribe. As I said, leave a comment below what you think of this wig or if you've had, you know what? Tell me about who you go to for wigs. Tell me the best person you go to for wigs or the best company. I would love to test out some other wigs um, that are recommended by you guys. And yeah, I will see you in the next one. Bye.